we're going on a global journey to explore some of the weird and wonderful things that have happened in the natural world. From the sea that turns to cappuccino, to the massive holes that open up and swallow buildings, to the apocalyptic deaths of thousands of birds on New Year's Eve. What makes that happen for them just to drop out of the sky like that? Using eyewitness accounts, news footage and scientists and experts, we're going to explain some of nature's weirdest events. For our first set of weird events, we're going to be looking at stories that had some people quaking in their boots. You see, when animals die in strange ways, superstitions run wild and many are left fearing that the end of the world is nigh. When a downright eerie event took place in the American Deep South, it spooked not just the locals, but people around the world. But first, we're travelling to California, where on the 8th of March 2011, the locals awoke to something quite extraordinary. As the sun came up over Redondo Harbour, an ominous scene was revealed. Overnight, the entire marina had become choked with death. Now, Californian authorities are carrying out a large-scale clean-up after a million dead sardines were found floating in a marina just south of Los Angeles. In some parts of King Harbour, the water was almost half a metre thick with dead fish. The carnage was incredible. Look, there was the odd survivor trying to make a bid to escape a grisly fate. But it was creepy, to say the least, and soon a worried crowd gathered to view this tragedy. Oh, it's sad. It's really sad. I can't believe how big these sardines are. Uh, it makes me wonder what's in the water. We're used to seeing fish hauled in by a trawler, but for more than a million to just die spontaneously, well, that's totally out of the ordinary. Speculation ran wild as to the cause of these alien scenes. I didn't think schools of fish could be this big. You know, there was way over a million. It's pretty mind-boggling, I think. 